the NIA that was seeking extension of custody for Sachin Vaze has got it. The NIA court has extended custody of Sachin Vaze and Time Star has now accessed Sachin Patil's statement. He says on the first I had gone to HM house to brief him on the issue of Thane bars and hookah parlors. I met Vaze in our office compound same day and when we chatted he told me that HM had asked if 3 lakh rupees are being collected from the 1750 bars and hookah parlors. Rakesh joining us, uh, Rakesh, he says, I don't know if Vaze and HM met in person. Then on 4th, I had a meeting with DCP Bujwal. I got to know he was meeting the HM at 8 p.m. He called me there. I went since there were meetings inside. We met Palande and kept walking and talking with him. Palande asked about the collection. We said, there is no such thing. When my then Commissioner Paramveer Singh asked me about the same thing on chat, I replied to him. This is Sachin Patil's statement breaking first on Times Now. Kajal Ayer joining us. Yes, Kajal. Yes, uh, this is the uh, officer with whom Parambir Singh had had a WhatsApp chat and he had actually uh, taken the support of this WhatsApp chat to say that there was this 100 crore Vasuli gate. What is interesting about this entire uh, statement is that it does seem like an uh, uh, attempt has been made to entirely give a different spin to it. Uh, the statement says uh, Sachin Patil has uh, told uh, the uh, Joint Commissioner of Crime, Milind Bharambe, in this statement that on the first I had gone to the Home Minister to brief him about Thane's hookah parlors and bars. After that, on the fourth, because one of my superior, uh, one of my uh, colleagues was there and I was supposed to meet him, I had gone there. At that time, I was told that. Uh, uh, and, and on the first, he met Sachin Vaze in his office premises, which is the CP office here at uh, uh, Mumbai. And Sachin Vaze told him that the Home Minister had asked him whether there was 3 lakh collection money being collected from bars and uh, restaurants. So this is completely opposite to what Parambir Singh's letter has said. And one doesn't know now where the truth lies, which is something that the NIA and the CBI will have to, in uh, the CBI rather, will have to investigate. Because Parambir claimed that 100 crores was asked from Sachin Vaze, while this uh, officer, whom Sachin Vaze had spoken to, and whose WhatsApp chat Parambir had relied on, is saying that it was the opposite. The Home Minister had wanted to know whether there was any vasuli happening on the part of the police establishment and whether they were collecting 3 lakh rupees from bars and uh, other establishments. So, a complete twist to the entire case right now and of course now the CBI will have to uh, corroborate these statements. The other officer, Bhujbal, whose uh, statement was also relied by on uh, by Parambir Singh, he has also given a statement. Let me read what, he says let, no, that no, one minute, just hold your thoughts. Let me read what Raju Bhujbal has said in his statement. On 4th, I was briefing the Home Minister about certain start questions he had to reply on for assembly session at that time. Sachin Patil also came. During the conversation with Palande, he told him that he did not know about de any details about the police establishment. After that, we left our separate ways. This is what Raju Bhujwal has said.